All right, fine. Let me move on then. I'm going to move on to the other crazy thing that happened on the show, which was Mariah May turning on Tony Storm out of nowhere. But she, she was in the Owen Hart Cup final, and she rolls up Willow to win. And Tony Storm comes out to celebrate with her as normal. You know, they've been together very, very, very friendly, if you know what I mean, Vlad. Very, very friendly for the past <laughs> few weeks. They love each other, apparently. And I'll just play this. I'll play this out right here. Let's let's just watch it straight and see how it happens. So they're running towards the Owen Hart Cup, and Brian May grabs the belt. No one handed it to her, and he just clocks Tony Storm. It looked good, though. <laughs> <The first time. laughs> in terms of the work this really looked good but and, and then she clocks Luther for anyone listening without video <laughs> and Luther took a bump off the ramp into the onto a table on the outside right which I'm glad to see Luther get some some run in a nice spot here in the main event but violent looking attack Tony Storm is bleeding profusely and it's just a shocking, shocking scene. There, there's the bump. There's the Luther bump. <laughs> Who did I start with last? Robert, did I start with you last? I want to go to Vlad first yeah. this time. Vlad, you uh, texted yeah. me. You said you, you said you wanted to give some thoughts about this angle on today's show. So go ahead. You have the floor. Well, yeah, look, I just want to say that obviously I don't have a problem with an angle like this in most cases. Like, like somebody turning on their mentor and whatnot. But this was literally came out of nowhere, dude. Like, literally, last week, they were uh, making out. And this week, <laughs> look what she's doing to her. <laughs> how, does, how does that make any sense whatsoever, booking-wise? It makes zero sense. Zero. If she was going to do it later on, before their match at All In, okay. But to do it right away, basically, she won the thing, and she b proceeds to beat the fuck out of her, man. And it made zero sense. Look at this. <laughs> this is ridiculous. So you're giving this a thumbs down or what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm giving this a thumbs down because it's too stupid. I'm, I'm not, like I said, it's nothing to do with the overall, well, it's everything to do with the, it's the timing of it is the issue. If they were going to end up at this point, they should have done it, like, maybe a couple weeks or maybe, like, yeah, like a couple of weeks probably prior to the pay-per-view. But right now, as soon as she won the match, this is crazy. This is literally insane. I can't say enough how much I hate what they did with the booking here um, because it just makes no sense. I'm sorry. You can't be kissing someone uh, one week and then the next week <laughs> just beating the oh, just total fuck out of them like this. It's insane. Oh, so, okay. No. You know what? I, I, I agreed with you on my rating, Vlad. I also gave it a thumbs down. But to play devil's advocate, at least it wasn't surprising, right? I mean, I mean, at oh. least it was surprising. Excuse me. At least... Oh, okay. You, you can, is there anything you could say to the fact that at least you didn't see it coming? No, because well, that doesn't mean that it's good booking. That just means that, like, you could say a lot of stuff that Vince Russo did was surprising. But that yeah. doesn't mean that any of it was actually good or it made any sense at all. This is kind of on par with that like it just made no sense it's it, it literally made no sense i'm sorry i mean if they waited a bit maybe if they waited a couple of weeks maybe like even to see the paper views august but yeah they could have waited there's no rush to do this i'm not sure why they did it right away they could have got to this point a little bit later where she beats her up like this i don't know why they did it right as soon as she won you know okay that's my only thing so no just because it's a surprise does not mean that it's good so, yeah. Okay, well, let's go to the other side of the coin. Robert actually enjoyed this. He gave it a thumbs up. So let's hear his thoughts. Okay, so I have some pros and one, maybe one con, but I'll start with the pros. Uh, I want to start off first by saying, if you remember a few months ago, I, I made a prediction that um, Mariah May would be the one to eventually take the belt off of Tony Storm. Because for me personally, the... The story writes itself, you know, the um, the mentor, the, the, the student surpassing the, the, the mentor. So that, that pretty much wrote itself, in my opinion. So I, I figured it should it should be Mariah May, May if anyone's going to take the belt off of Tony. Um, so to me, it wasn't a surprise. Um, here's the thing. 
usually when oh uh, before i go on I, I think this is probably the first time i saw a heel turn that involved an attack using heels <laughs> <laughs> just saying just saying that was awesome <laughs> <laughs> but uh, okay so all right <laughs> usually all right almost every time there's a, a heel turn even even if there were no hints in the angle that th it was going to happen usually like i can see it coming like at least five seconds before it before the actual turn happens that's true you see right so so for example like uh you when a, a match ends usually the camera turns towards the commentators or the or it cuts to a backstage segment or whatever but well or um but but if the camera just stays on the ring as opposed to cutting to the commentator or a backstage segment you kind of get an idea okay something's about to go down and then you you could also kind of tell by the body language of, from the person that's about to turn, yeah. Like yes. that person's gonna do something. So so in my head, I, I kind of have this countdown in my head. All right, this person's gonna turn in like five, four, three, two. Ah, oh, there it is. It happened. Uh, e even if there was nothing uh, in the angle that hinted towards it, this was different because there the, there was nothing hinting. I I couldn't see it being telegraphed like I usually see it see for other heel turns so that was the surprise for me was how it was executed this was executed differently than most heel turns um i will agree with so, that it was so different. yeah I, yeah so i don't have a the problem with the turn and it wasn't really a surprise to me but the surprise was the execution of it uh so now i only have one con okay because uh, i remember i predicted months ago that it would be mariah may that takes the title off of tony if if that was the plan all along that Mariah May would be the one, right? Uh, they should have built her up to be really, really legit, like le the legit um, wrestler that that's capable of of being the champ and taking taking the title away from Tony, right? They they should have made her look really, really strong these uh, past few months. There was one match not too long ago, I want to say maybe like a month ago, where she went one on one with Soraya. Mm -hmm. And she lost pretty clean and without without much shenanigans from Soraya's part. So it didn't it didn't make her look good. So I, I kind of doubted my prediction after seeing that. Like I I I was for sure thinking, oh, it's going to be Mariah. Mariah is going to be the one taking it off of Tony. But then she looked really weak in that match, losing pretty cleanly to Soraya. So I I don't know why they booked that. Um, I, I don't understand that booking decision because they should have just made her look strong throughout the past few months. Uh, so that was the only hiccup. <laughs> um, I would say that the one con is that they didn't make her really look that good, like a, a legit title contender, but that was it. Um, right. But I think I gave this one thumbs up. I, uh, you, know, you gave it too. a thumbs up, yes. You yeah. gave it a thumbs up. All right, so Vlad likes those little segments sometimes in wrestling where there's at least like a little eye wink or something or, or you know, something, a close-up to a side <laughs> eye, you know, something that just shows that, may, yeah, she, she was complete. They were completely super, super, super friends with no hint of anything. So, yes, it was a little weird, but okay.